Hey everybody, Trinda here. I have a Dollar Tree haul. I stopped into Dollar Tree because I needed a couple things and they had all their Valentine's stuff out. So I got a whole bunch of stuff. Sorry for the lighting, uh, but let me go ahead and show you what I got. I'm gonna start with this fun stuff. All these signs I love. I don't know what you call these kinds that sit up, but I thought that was so cute. Follow your heart with the little arrow. Adorable. I love the little red truck. Happy Valentine's Day, and it's all glittery. The only thing with Dollar Tree is you gotta be careful that glitter usually comes off. Now this is one of my favorites. This one with the little bicycle with the hearts. I thought that was so cute. And then this one, love. They had another one that said welcome. I thought it was cute if you wanted it for your front door. And then this one that just says happy Valentine's Day. So adorable, I thought for the price, really cute. Now this is something I've never seen in Dollar Tree. I thought this was so cute. Now Dollar Tree Valentine's cards go fast for like the kids. Well, at least they did back by my old house. I don't know here, but it was like, you gotta grab them while you can. So anyways, I saw these and I just thought these were so cute. So they come apart. So this comes with six cards and these are actually erasers. Aren't those cute little movable, bendable erasers and you get six. And it's just nice because this could be for a boy or a girl, doesn't matter. Then on the back, you put your little to and from. So I got those for Nixon, my four-year-old. I thought that would be so cute for his preschool class. So I ended up he has 24 kids in his class, but I ended up getting 30 just in case. You never know a new kid comes or give one to the teacher, whatever. So I got three of the erasers because I thought those were the cutest. But then I did get a couple of these. I thought these were so adorable as well. These little dinosaurs, which every kid likes, boys and girls. And this one does not have the to and from on the back. So we will just need to write that in. I don't know where we write it in. Maybe I'll just on the back. So, so cute. They did have some like girly erasers with like little purses and makeup bags and stuff like that. That was really cute as well if you have a girl. But I just thought that was the cutest little Valentine's that I've ever seen. So I thought that was a great find. I had no idea Dollar Tree had t-shirts. I don't know if this is just like they got a bunch of them in or what. Well, my kids had gotten these patches from a bookstore the other day. They um, love Dogman, and so they got some Dogman. It's a book series if you're not familiar. Uh, patches, so I needed a shirt to put them on, and so this was like a great find. Same color. It says adult tees, but I got, I think I got, what extra small so that will fit my big boys and I'm going to put the patches on there so they can wear them I thought that was a really great find and then for New Year's Eve we're going over to a friend's house and I really hate bringing over a dish that I need to bring home because then if we leave early I don't want to take the food back and I don't want to have to meet up later to get it back. So I just went ahead and got two platters. So for our two dishes, we will just leave them there. When we go, I don't have to worry about them. They had um, round ones, a whole bunch of different sizes. So I thought that was great. This, I have no use for it yet, but I just really love this container. Sorry, if you could hear the alarm going off, I went and uh, turned it off. Anyways. I don't know exactly what I'm going to use this for, but I thought this was just such a neat storage container. It could be for art supplies, you know, pens, pencils, something for the kids, for little, if you have toys with little pieces. They had a couple different colors. I thought that was just a really cool storage container I've never seen before. I got the kids these for Valentine's. These are like the little conversation hearts, but they're Sour Patch. I thought they would love that. And then Carter's birthday party is going to be soon. And I was looking at invitations online and they are super expensive. So of course at the Dollar Tree, I went and got, I got more than I needed just in case. I got 32, just really easy. And they are supposed to be $3.89 each. 
And so this is great for a dollar each. Then I also got him this foil balloon, number eight. I thought that was really cute. And then I can't go without getting my kids a little something. Nixon has been asking for bubbles, so I got this three pack of bubbles. And for Carter, I picked up this light up spinner. I thought that was really cool. And then for my Lego obsessed kid, I thought this was really neat. And actually the cashier said she was gonna have to go grab that. So it says use over and over again. So I don't know if they come off, but 47 and they come with all these stickers you can put on your Legos, which I thought was just really, really neat. Little things you can put on your minifigures. I just thought that was really cool. So for $24, I am super happy with this haul. Considering if I had bought the invitation somewhere else, that probably would have cost me close to that by themselves. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And leave me a comment down below. I want to know if you decorate for Valentine's Day. I know some people do, some people don't. I'm curious if you do. And make sure you are subscribed for more videos. And I will see you next time, guys. Bye-bye.